we we Hit low G, low G, low gravity. We've done uh, we've done two uh, two and three like back to back, so I don't think we're gonna do returns for a little bit. Oh, you're gonna yeah. duck on 64 first. Maybe. Well, don't you plan to play that blind? Or you plan you plan to stream that first, don't you? Uh. Yeah, prob I'm probably gonna stream that before I think about L an LP. Okay, it's a really big, it's a really big collect upon. Yeah. Ah! It's your cosmic wall here. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah. If I was, <laughs> I was like. Uh, yeah, then... you gotta use a team up move around there, I think. Oh. Um, I'll say. Um, uh, what does it say? Just before you get the con. Yeah, uh, just before the con get to play as quarks, there's a stack of three buzzers. The con use the team up move to reach the barrel. Here they're able to play as quarks. Quarks will need to collect all 80 stars in 25 seconds. Quarks is the purple one. Yes. Oh, I, I, I was about to say, like, are you, are you, is, are you pronouncing it? Uh, weird or? Uh. Weird thing is that once you get the clocks or squawks or aim for this one, um, it, there's a little less of a low G. G. Yeah, G. Uh, when you say it out loud, loud, when you say it out loud, it sounds like you're trying to, like, be cool or something. Low G library. Low G. I, I do like the name of the level though. The name of it. Mm. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Gosh darn it, Kitty, you're so slow. Yo! Is that the piggybacking? No. no. He's dead. Ow! And Kitty was happy about it. <laughs> oh. oh, wait. Jeez, Dixie. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. That's payback. <laughs> Oh. Uh -huh. Look at Kitty's mouth. Yeah. He's just enjoying yeah. himself. Yep. Okay, by the way, that's not the way you're supposed to do that. Oh. <laughs> you're supposed How you... to get in here as quarks. Oh. oh. So he missed it. No, he's up ahead. Oh. Well, screw you, level design. Like that—that's an exploit that looks like it's, it was intentional. Is the thing? Yeah, yeah. This is in the path. So it's just squawks, but without the uh, the uh, attack. In in parachute panic. Remember, he was the one. Oh no, no. You can still pick up stuff. You can pick up that barrel over there. Oh. Oh. Hold the button above it. Oh. There's a, um, there is an animal, there is a, app, an anim, there is a level later on where you have to play as Fox with the whole thing, I think. Hmm. Um, it's, um, a buzzer barrage. Hmm. You go down a lot slower in this level. Yeah. Oh, low. What's in these pipes that are making it, that are causing low, G, low gravity? Low gravity, wee. Some weird chemicals. <laughs> yeah, well, it yeah ah! it has to be a smoke. <laughs> the power of getting hit made me face for a wall. <laughs> Yay! How far are we from the uh, bus? Well, there's a little oh, right before it. I just forgot Low G Labyrinth was here. What, there's another. I think mean, there's one, one more uh, pipe level later. Mm. It's around the end. And that's gonna. And it's poisonous pipeline. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I've heard. I've and heard. that's the one where it reverses your controls. Yeah, I've heard about that. So is it purple? The gas purple, I mean. In uh, what? In that one? Yeah. Well, the water is purple. The thing is, it's only po it's only the water that does it. Mm. So the moment you jump out of the water, your controls go back to normal. I've heard it makes it can make like jumping up to a platform kind of confusing. Funny. Yeah. 
I don't even go between those, can you? No, I'm pretty sure I can't. <sighs> oh, what? Oh, wow, that is extremely tight. Wait, okay, why uh, am I? I, think this is, I don't think this is the way you're supposed to go with the thing. Oh. Where, where even um, am I? Berber, I think you took a shortcut, basically. Did I miss things? Yeah. I should have been in our bonus level. Oh. Yeah, I think it was right below you where that <sighs> TNT was. Hmm. Imagine you're playing this game without us. When uh, I was guiding you, how long would it take? Um, I can, well, I'd probably- I mean, I'd, I have no doubt that you would find, eventually be able to do it. I'd be able to beat the game, but I don't think I'd be able to find all the secrets. If Liam were here, he'd probably, he'd probably be done with the game. <laughs> yeah, probably. I, I- I, I want to actually see see him in action, see his gameplay in action. If you also want, if you want another good run of DKC3, um, the Brain Scratch run is actually phenomenal. Oh, they did a DKC3. A while ago, like three years ago. Oh wow, I didn't even know. Go down from here. <laughs> Where's there nothing down there? Keep going. Ah. Oh. Uh. And they'll find a DK coin around. Well, you gotta have squawks first. Yay! True Go. Gilbert got bird. The slightly better one. Oh, that's a big surprise! <laughs> oh, but that's incredible. I think I might have a heart attack and die from that surprise. Are any of the animal bodies like in the DK cartoon thing? Uh, I think Squawk shows up. Oh. Probably just, probably just, probably just as a bird, though. You know? Yeah, I'm pretty. <laughs> like, imagine if they actually gave him a voice. Iago. <laughs> oh yeah, it's here. Grab that barrel. Ah. Uh. It should be here, anyways. Uh, can you, can uh, someone like quickly look up like Squawk's Donkey Kong TV show or something now? I'm looking it up now. <laughs> or not. Oh, is it here? The left. Oh. Oh, there it is. Keep going. No, he does not oh, show no. up. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Right here. I know what you have to do. He does not um, show up. Use a safe state. He does not show up in the in, in our all. No. Go to the sign. He shows, up, he shows up in the comics, but that's it. Oh, do I, any of sign. do any of the animal body? Oh, okay. Anim animal body show up. Uh, let's see. Restart. So that's one. That's one of those instances of one try. Considering how the battle shows up, yeah. Oh, 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 stupid. You just hit him. Stupid bucket on your head. Oh, I got a bucket. Ho oh, ho! Ice bucket challenge! Dang it. I thought it was gonna... That was way... I thought I was the... gonna say, that was way too low. I thought the arc was gonna be higher than that. Dang it. Can you bounce from the lower section, maybe? Like, grab the barrel, jump up. Mm. Like, how far can you jump up with that, though, is the question, you know? Yeah. You can reach up. No, nah, it's not gonna be high <laughs> enough. Oh. Oh, it's, it's, it's gone? It's not, yeah. One moment. Um, no, none of the I animal the buddies cats. show up. Oh, that's lame. I wanna, <laughs> yes. I wanna see Rambi go like, Oh yeah, I'm gonna bash some Kremlings. You're like a big brute. Apparently, Donkey Kong Country was the first full-length television series to be entirely animated using motion capture. <laughs> oh man. Oh, that's well, now we learn. So uh, that means all the uh, that means all the dance moves were were. were... <laughs> oh what? What? Huh? Take it. I, I think I think I think you just hit below the hitbox. I'll take They're it. Below its shield box. Careful. 
<sighs> All right, now we're at the end of the level. Oh, by the way, want to do something funny? What? Um, get one of these steel kegs to the end of the level. Oh, dang it. Oh, it's fine. What I was gonna say, to, if you got to the end of the level, place the barrel right in front right in front of a checkpoint right there. Mm. And then jump on. It looks like Dixie's hugging it. <laughs> and now we go for the boss. It, it just looks like someone's house. It talks oh. to you. What? Click. Kong. Enemy. That's new. You must be... Destroyed. Hmm. Huh. I kind of miss. Away from it, cause the eggs also hurt you. Yeah, they get as much. Hey, mom. Put up. Jump on those. Oh. Dang it. One mom. No clue, actually. Okay. You just need to jump on the head. This guy actually has multiple phases. So how's the uh, doomsday device going, uh, Jason? <laughs> I was going okay. <laughs> just, gotta, just gotta kick out the bugs. Not doing it. Just turn straight. Don't bother like moving forward until you get to the top. Oh, did I actually count? Yep. Oops. He's a lot faster with that now. Chaos. Chaos carnage. Chaos control. What? You glitched it. <laughs> no, yeah. that won't work. Yeah, boy, I love glitching stuff. We already glitched Dixie earlier. <laughs> the best part is that all of these are unintentional. I never tried to intentionally do glitches. The only glitch I ever done on purpose. Was um, that one I showed you in Kingdom Hearts 1 in order to get a, a free treasure, an early treasure in uh, Halloween Town? Yeah. And I should want to count in the uh, thing, the uh, sliding dashes in Birth by Slave. It's not really a glitch, it's more of a sequence break. Yeah. It depends, it, it depends, though. Like, I generally. Associate them as well, similar like, things. Well, like, using something the game gave you for, for an outside purpose. Yeah. Dang it. I should probably start safe staying more. I don't know, I find a game like this a little more interesting if you don't use safe states. Mm. But I know we're going to sort of take a time, but... Yeah. Ah, click! I could say something about what chaos is, but I'm not going to. Oh, spoilers? Yeah. Yes. Oh. oh, if you jump, it just cancels it out. Oh. Oh, you looked up what chaos is then, uh, Rappy? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> oh, you. <laughs> that sounds funny out loud. On it. Yeah. Thing is, running at the hard part. Mm. Oh, it's gonna get me. I keep on thinking it's gonna go out sooner. I have a tape recorder on it. Mm. It's gonna punch me. I'm not gonna have enough time. What is even swinging around at you? It doesn't hurt you. It looks. It looks like they're supposed to be knives. Yeah. Close. They stay here just so we don't have to hear the dialogue again. Well, it doesn't take that long. Like, yeah, see, like, those don't hurt you. They look like they should chop you up. Even then, the, the only thing that really hurts you in the first part is the exhaust. Yeah. 
I guess uh, like the fact like the fact that you have to jump on them uh, is like it'll be kind of like wow if, if it did hurt you. I guess a bit evil. Oh crap! I don't know. I think you're just staying a little too far as the thing there. Yeah. Boom. No, it didn't count. It was too slow. Right. Why? 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 Now I can go race. Dang it. Indeed. No, I didn't. Nope. Yeah, you had to see it react like, dum, dum, dum. Yeah. I still say these bosses have more of a presence than the ones in DKT2. Hmm. I don't know oh. that. What? Well, no, I mean, like, like, what I mean is something like Cleaver, the sword. When you're most of the time, you're yeah. running away from it. Yeah, some of the bosses in DK... Pro, we just kind of flying around the top. Yes, some of the bosses in 2 are just kind of the like... What, what even is like that random sword like supposed to be? What what what, what is uh, Cleaver supposed to, er, supposed to be? Yeah, it's just like I get it's like a, a, a sword and all that, but like... It's so random. The hand, the hand and all that, right? Yeah. It's just a sentient sword, as far as I'm concerned. Like, this is the leader the of the only ones that really stick out to, The only ones that really stick out to me are like, um, um, Clubba, or mm. Kuja, and Kujal, or Kujal, whatever, and, Perfect. uh, what's the other one? Um, Karul himself. Mm. I mean, I. Don't get me wrong, I did like the uh, bosses in DKC2, but like the what they actually were was just so random. King Zing's thing. Mm. I mean, Kerosene in the GBA at least has presence. Oh yeah, that one in the thing. Dang it. That's why I say, like, only, the only ones that really stick out to me, like, in fact, the only ones I can remember off the top of my head besides the sword are, uh, are, are, uh, Kujal and, uh, King Karul. Hmm. Oh, okay, I bet he you got know, that. You no, know, Karul has the benefit of being boss, but, obvious, but. Yeah. Ugh. Like, finish my ponytail there. You have to, yeah. You have to try to forget K. Roll. It's Vinny. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, it's Pizza the Hot Assistant Vinny. Jeez. Dang it. Uh, His real head looks bigger than the helmet he was using to cover it. <laughs> Now you gotta get running because now it's gonna shoot lasers at you. Oh. What oh. The frig Jeez. This is more like a Sonic boss now. Oh. I think oh. it's only one more hit here, actually. Or no, one more, I guess. Your store point. Well, he's going, yeah, whoa! Oh, what? Jesus Christ! Gills. Indeed. That should do it. Kong. Kong win? win? <laughs> Does not. Does not compute. Next time we meet, chaos will reign. That should have been computed off a K. Ah. Uh. Let's head in the cotton. We'll just hit the cotton top cove and, and then call it. Yep. I actually need to 
head off now. That's what I'm saying. We're calling. We're calling it a session here. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we're heading to the water level. Nope. I kind of like the. I kind of like the first water level. Okay. I love it. The uh, ambient piece, actually. All right. Well, we shall see what that brings us next time. Good night, yeah. everyone. Okay. Bye. Can you see? Yeah, I can see. It's like Fry and the others kicked in. We're trying to gather, uh, like, particles or something. They're to help, like, the, the professor make it, like, superhuman basketball players or something like that. And then because of that, time skips are happening everywhere. Mm. So it's like, uh, it's like they need some kind of doomsday device in order to create a black hole to get rid of all the bad stuff, right? Mm-hmm. So, so it's like, doomsday device, you say, but he like reveals like seven of them. I suppose I could still part with one and still be feared. I'm gonna put this in the episode. <laughs> Alright, welcome, welcome back to Kremlin Stole My, Stole My Bananas Free. <laughs> I love how these, I love these, how these levels look. Oh yeah, there's a, there's I didn't know gonna let play now. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I was loud. <laughs> Alrighty then. That's his blockade, was it? Yeah. yeah. Alright, just so you know, um, every time we get into one of these water levels, the crank in the DK coin is always at the end. Alright. Oh, really? So that'll save you some trouble. Ah, uh, yeah. Not too long for the little left. Left your cave. The apes can find a school. Hmm? What? You cut off. School of what? The apes can find a school of bats that's swimming across the top of a large alcove. They just swim below them to find a bonus barrel. Oh. Oh right, yeah, I've seen I've seen that before. Alright. So how would you how do you feel about this uh, level then, uh Jason? Um, in terms of like comparing it to other water levels, visually I like it more than I actually like it more than, than like below the deck kind of level than uh, DKC two. Uh, all the, yeah. You know, I like these coral reef settings. Yeah, I was I wasn't I'm honest I wasn't honestly not too big of a fan of those levels visually. I mean, like even though the ones in Donkey Kong Country one were still kind of you know they were they had what pure like a one color background. I, I know, thought I they still. still look... I love their, I love their music so much. It's aquatic I... ambient. It's still one of my favorite pieces in Donkey Kong in history. Definitely, and uh, I just like the uh, natural look of it. Yeah, even though I don't know if there's coral reefs in Canada. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I like. I still like how these look, a lot. I wasn't expecting like these these guys to. Uh, be what the there. bosses? Yeah. I think those things are called urches, by the way. Those uh, spiny things. Right. Oh, jeez. Two coming out? Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that either. Was that like... The second bonus level will be found... No, the second bonus level will be found... <laughs> oh, come on! ...will be found shortly after... ...shortly after passing the level Star Barrel. Cool. The can find a parallel, narrow passage to their left and right. The path to the left leads to a wider area with a bonus barrel. All oh, right, because it's one of those um, non-linear paths, but you just gotta guess which way. Oh. Right. Guesswork. If you remember. Well, like if you, once it gives once it gives you a split path, it should be pretty obvious. Yeah. Well, I mean, like I hope you remember like the the, the good ways to go. <laughs> I don't think there's a lot of those, so. No, it's still at least, you know, like, I'm glad, you know, it's crappy explaining all this, but I'm at least glad I can see it from, anyway, I know which way to go as soon as I see it on your screen. Yeah. Like, I, I guess that really is this, this game sticks out to me. Is this the one you're the most familiar with? N what, DKC3? Yeah. No, um, hmm. in terms of, ex well, I played one the most. I know. <laughs> okay, <all right>. <laughs> <laughs> I played one the most. Um, two, I... I still like. I think is overall the better game, even though I still will play one more. Right. Yeah. So I'm in. I'm in the same boat. I think 
three is in like I said, right. like I said before, three is the middle of the road for me, right. and and that's and that all and so like, now I also played it more or less recently, so I'm just kind of glad that like, oh god, um, some of the bonuses are in play, are pretty simple enough to find. It just it's sometimes it's more of the reach than the find. I like those more. I kind of like that idea more. Mm. You know what I mean? Like you see your goal, now how you get to it. Right. Yeah, I, I, I guess I, I might have so. to go with my Metroid experience, so. Hmm. Right. You know I mean? It seems like there's something over there, but I don't think I can reach that. No, that's where the, that's where the thing is. How do I? Go back. Go back. Go back. Stay low. Oh, you were gonna say you reach that you had to stay low so that they won't hit you. Oh, it it doesn't look like I can. It looks like they're just gonna I think... hit me. Yeah, it looks like that. Oh, oh. dang it. <laughs> I went down too slow. Appearances can be deceiving. Or maybe to quote uh, Yoshimitsu, Overconfidence is the greatest enemy. Hmm. Evil oh, Koopa really Wizard. Overconfident, what am I saying? Evil Koopa Wizard. Evil Koopa Wizard. Evil cool it. <laughs> and uh, freaking Mario cartoon. That's from the uh that's from free, right? Uh well Mario Free cartoon? Th I'm pretty sure it's, it's from oh, Mario World. Yeah. Wait, am I going backwards? No go go left, go left. No, because like there's the Are you sure? Bo there's the bonus barrel down there when we did that. You went backwards? Yeah. Oops. I guess the I, I I guess the banana trail at the beginning was ain't was supposed to tip you off a bit. Yeah. You almost did it again. Are you? Are, I think you did. Are you doing it? You're doing it again. Am I? Yes. I'm pretty sure you are. Wait, what? Yeah, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> yeah, I think that trail banana is supposed to be your hint is egg. Remember, go this way. Mm. Yep, now we're going the right way. Remember, you can go left <laughs> and we'll get up, up here. He's gotta kinda of stay low. Yeah. Or rather, when we get around. I always like the swimming in this more than like Mario 1 at least, or anything like that. Mm. You know, cause like, Mar even though you can't necessarily defend yourself unless you in like, unless you had, um, on guard. Crap! Um, the thing is, like, it, it's like, you, it feel like you have a bit more control of your movement in here. Like Mario, uh, Mario goes a kind of jolt, hmm. jolty ish. Some, uh, I, I don't think like these controls are perfect either. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not saying they are. I'm just saying yeah, I find I like these a lot more than the ones in like Mario One. Mario Three is is it maybe may, maybe I'll say is that that one's better. Mm. Mario Three still has some jank. <laughs> Well, I mean, like Mario like 3, these... it's like, um, when you're going down, it's like, oh, I think Mario 1 did too. It's like, when you when you go down and hit swim, you kind of like, like, kind of like, stop, and stop yourself for a moment and it goes slightly up, and then you have to keep mashing it. I, I never really cared for, um, underwater levels in these old classic games. Like, it just, something about them just feels jank to me. Hmm. Like, I, I like how this barrel is just here. Yeah, I can't tell you how long it took me to beat World 3 and Mario 3. My, 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 mom and my, my mom and my aunt still can't do it. Like that... Good. Hit my butt. Um, like, Mario 3 just doesn't know the meaning of uh, difficulty balance. No, World, World 3 is a lot harder than World 4, and World 7 is a lot harder than World 8. World well, 7 just has a lot more t has a lot more in it. Yeah. But, like the difficulty just seems to be all over the place. 
Like, I can't, like, I heard the difficulty was very, like, bad in, like, Star Fox? Uh, the original? Yeah, NES, or Super Nintendo, mm -hmm. in, 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 NES Star Fox, how about that? <laughs> no, I, I've, I've heard it gets pretty ridiculous. Good thing by Johnny. I don't, yeah, I don't really have that much to go off of, but... Careful, you only have one hit left. Yeah, that's true. Ah! Come! Yeah, so you have the DK coins in the last bit. Mm -hmm. Nice. Nice. Oh, what the heck is this? Bounty bath. What? Okay, no. Okay. It's, it's like the birds, basically. Alright. Yeah. The on guard's model get improved also, or am I just... Uh, it looks a little bit cleaner. I'm trying to imagine what a, like, a pre-rendered Donkey Kong Country 4 on a Nintendo 64 would look like. <laughs> oh, this looks interesting. Avoid that. Don't touch that flagpole. Keep go right. Just go right. Uh... Keep, keep going, keep going. Oh, oh, okay. I was wondering if it was like, gonna... Do that? Do it. Yeah. Do that what, you thought it was gonna be a screen lock or something? Of it? No, no, I, I thought, I thought Dixie was just gonna automatically go on it, go on it. No, you had to jump and touch it. Oh, that's interesting. There was a of a blockade. Oh, I like these levels. Oh, is this, uh... Origins, Origins of DKC Returns? No. Oh. Or is it? Mm. Uh, kind of, but... <laughs> Not here, but later. You'll see, you'll guys see later. Wait, can I go on that? Oh, oh. Didn't s That's cool. Didn't see the platform there. Yeah. I also like how you go in front and behind the waterfalls. Yeah. The yeah, first puzzle will be found just after the letter O. Alright. Um, get in the booster barrel and right up to another barrel. To the left of where the first booster barrel lets the Kong out will be a green buzz. I should and blast a knick knack on the other side of it, right? And bounce on the red knick knacks next to it. Alright. Where's Dang. the Kong letter? Just, so where's the DK coin, just so we're sure? The far left of the level flagpole. <laughs> No, oh, that's the kind of thing they did in like Squawk Shaft right there. Yeah. By the way, guys, for times of, I mean, for time of reference of this video, Mania came out today. And uh, in terms of like other reference, um, I've right now I've uh, recorded up um, up to Press Garden Zone. And I've just finished um, the zone right after that. Yep. But I've started to play the let's play, and to do the let's play with you guys. Yeah. Oh, was that a secret? Or was that that, was that always the... I think you're supposed to go this to go up. Well, yeah, I get that, but like, the, the one in the waterfall. Go back to that, then. Yeah, it was a secret. There's nothing up here, though. There were bananas earlier. Oh. Coin. Oh, right. <laughs> well, even. It was items. Whatever. It was items. Collectible. Ugh. Um, these blue, big blue guys are basically like crushes. Right. What do uh, these coins do again? Only, um, they let you you buy you use them to buy stuff in the bears. The bears. Oh dang it! <laughs> Did I hear a pop? Hmm. And here comes Scrappy's Mario dog. Bear, bear, bear. Go back. That butt. To hey, left. Let me get that first. 
Oh. I think I'm oh, I supposed see. to do it like that. But it's easier that way. If I, ah! I'm, I'm, where am I? Just a little down. All right, it's fine. Yeah, she can do it an easier way than why not? Did you uh, did you pass by it again? Right here, right here. So. Cool. Bonus stage. I think I see. I see where this is going. I did not want, want to jump into all those. Oh, I didn't even see. I didn't even see that. Yeah, you're not gonna make it. Yeah, I'm you're right. <laughs> the stars blended into the background for me. Mm hmm. Oh crap. <laughs> Whoa. What? No. What I just look at you went through some of the floor. It was probably because they were like in the background or something. Oh, you're on the same plane. Yeah. No, I, I uh, anticipated where the beat the uh, barrel was wrong. Right, make sure you hold right as soon as you get off this one right here. Alright. There's gonna be someone on the other side. Alright, cool. Alright. Yay. <clears throat> yeah, it's just because I, I kept on getting sent on the barrels and I didn't want it to be. Mm. That's not really a hard one at all. The fact that it kept launching you up really screwed you over. Alright, where's the second one, uh, Scrap? Ah! What? <clears throat> not too long before... Not too long before the no animal sign, the monkeys will see an auto-fire barrel. From there, just... Uh... From there, they should head to the right foot. For peace. Mm -hmm. Head to the right behind a wide wall to encounter two crumples moving back and forth at the same time. After defeating the enemies, the Kongs use their team up move, making Kitty throw Dixie through the air. If they use this move near the center of the waterfall behind them, they will land on a bonus barrel. Okay, this. You have to stay on the ground level if you want to get in the barrel. Because, see, you're behind the waterfall. Alright. We have to do something to catch you. No, I'm not falling. Not for, this again. I'm not falling for that. Normally, again. yeah, yeah, because of stuff like this, I usually wait a moment. Yeah. I I, I usually let the bar lo barrel launch me one more. Okay, after this, it's to the. What's it? Right. There should be a no animal sign. I see this. All right. Yeah. Keep Perry safe. 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 All right. This is a unique animal, buddy. He flies parallel to you. Alright. Oh, that Get was... it, Perry. <laughs> oh, this is nasty. How long does this go on for? A little bit. Oh, come on! I slid off the thing. The bear, the bear, and, and Perry got lost too. Oh, it happened again, dang it. What exactly happened? Huh? What exactly happened? Um, I like slide, slid off the platform. Hmm. You know, I would love it if our, if the run that, the, oh. there it is again. I would love the run that Liam records for us as a toughest run. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, uh, I think he's. I think he said he's, he still has, hasn't done it. Oh, it's hard. It's really hard. Oh come on, no. Ugh. I think after the third one, right once you get to that DK, bro, maybe you should just do the safe state to be safe. Yeah, this uh, insane trilogy hitboxes right now. I carry his mission to fuck as a hitbox. Right here, here, here. Cause this one was just... I... I... Oh, you lose not the high road. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> oh, cool. Uh... 
Where am I? Yeah, I think that's where the. I think that's where the. Uh, 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 oh, switch it, uh, Kitty. All right. I jump on these guys. Oh, I'm, right. Trying to say the Donkey Kong situation. Yep. All right. Uh, going. Oh, uh, two crims walking back and forth together. Oh wait a minute. Um, did you say pair up and toss up? Uh. Where is oh, it? I see. Yeah, it. There it is. There it is. That's kind of hidden. Oh, yeah. that's another way of getting up. That's the second way of getting up there. Oh well, it works. Oh yeah, I like how we still have parry. It's helping in this a lot. I never seen Perry in this bonus room, actually. <laughs> Wait, see, so we didn't even need him. Wait, where's the coin, though? The coin's on the left of the flagpole. Alright, then we'll just keep going. Well, there should be a no animal sign coming up. Oh, come on. Ah! Hang on. I think we skipped the no animal sign. Oh, I know what you have to do here. I know what you have to do here. There's no back wall, alright? So, you do a trick to this. Oh, dang it. Oh, jeez. The trick to that, what you're supposed to do is toss the barrel up so it rolls slowly, then use that cannon to uh, launch you up, and then it'll launch you to the other side so a coin faces you. Hmm. No, because no, there's no back wall. Here, I'll show you what you do. Take that, like, stand, like, stand uh, a little more to the right. Oh, uh, no more. Like, stand under that launch barrel. Alright. No, no, wrong way. This that one? one? Stand under oh, there, okay. yeah, and toss it up. Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh, I get it, I get it. I heard you talking about the uh, one ins inside the platform. Yeah, you have to do that, you get it? Yeah. Well, I just said that I did. Well, you keep throwing it to the right. Wait, what? Go. No, you need to use a launch barrel in order to shoot you to the other side of them, so he'll, he'll face you. Oh. Oh, if I had to, uh, throw it into the barrel. See, that's clever, isn't it? Yeah. I can't believe you actually missed the no animal sign. I've never seen that. <laughs> Oh, the other one should be in their little, like, lakeside limbo. Yeah, creeping crass, uh, classes. We haven't been back in this level truck since the beginning. Yep. Shortly after the letter K, the heroes on a, uh, the heroes are on a tightrope where they find two buzzes quickly moving above them. Before being hit by the wasp-like foes, they must jump to the small rope above them and then hop into the bonus barrel above that. Yeah, just don't touch the water. Right. Yeah, I kind of figured. Up there, up there. Ooh. How come that one shot you out? Uh, some of them do, I guess. Look, I guess it's where it's placed. Yeah. By the way, we're actually coming up to where I went to where I currently kind of stopped in my uh, toughest run. <laughs> Um, the level, of the, the last level in this world, by the way, it's on the boss. Hmm. The next, I know where the next one is. It's like, a, a, it's like between two class, in class, it's like, you have to drop down, and there's some two class, like, moving back and forth, and you have to quickly drop down twice. Hmm. Uh, just, <laughs> just for formality, what does it say? <laughs> right, there, right down there, right down there. Oh, okay. Never mind. Alright, the coin should be at the end, right? Let's see. Ah! Yeah, it's at the end of the level. Dang it! Yeah. It's gonna be hard, tough to get back in between those two. Ah! I don't think we hit a check- did we hit a checkpoint? I think so. Oh, I think we- no, we did. Oh god! <laughs> that guy was coming right at you. Yeah. He's coming out, I know it.
This is trickier than you think. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but timing is tight, isn't it? A little bit, yeah. I mean, at least as long as you have two Kongs. Dang yeah. it! <laughs> the barrel space. Yeah. Hmm. I don't want to risk you trying, trying this. I was gonna say roll off and see if you can hover. You wanna try it? Well, not roll off, just really slowly. <laughs> oh, he's. Mm, maybe. The thing is, if you miss, you're either gonna get hit by the by by them or the uh, you know, or the or the guy down there. The piranha thing. I forget what they're called in this game. Oh, uh, see. I think I, I got that down now. Do you want to save stage just in case so we don't have to go for that tight spot again? Alright. Just don't, let the, time, just don't let the timer intimidate you. What? I thought, were, I thought the, the piranhas were called nibblas. What, what do they call it? Cruncher? I don't know. I wonder, I wonder what XA's opinion is on this game. Who? Well, you, you plan to watch the review when we're done, right? Uh, if you want to. Well, I thought you know when you're done with the game. Uh, uh, maybe. So you don't, cause, cause you know, ah, uh, spoiler alert. <laughs> I mean, yeah? story, story wise, I don't really care that much. Mm-hmm. Get Bell to the right. Keep going. I always get paranoid. Are you keeping it your arm if you gonna jump up to it? Yeah. Jump on him and then... I think... <laughs> I feel like I can do it like that. I always just toss it up like that when I'm standing on him and there's a back wall. Dang it. <laughs> Is it... Okay, I'm gonna check something. Is it possible? Okay, this time I'm by the water. Now there's the whale hit me. Um, what? is this gonna work? Oh my goodness, that's brilliant! How did you do it? What did you do? Did you put I, it down? I just held down. I missed it. <laughs> that is uh, amazing. This should be another walk. This should be another, uh, oh, track about tracks. Alright, oh, this is the one that's like the Sonic Color Spring. 